Welcome everyone, Dr. Mandel here. Everyone wants to take the best, healthiest route to stay well. So we refer to the old vegetables and fruits, but the big problem is how clean are they? The whole world is revolving on pesticides and fungicides and whatever other sides they're putting in our fruits and vegetables. We really don't even know what's going into our body, regardless if it says organic in our stores. So there are a few great remedies in cleaning your fruits and vegetables. Many of us may just wash it with water, dab it with a cloth. We have baking soda, we have salts and other things like vinegar. But what really is the best for you? So many studies will tell you that washing just with water, yes, will remove lots of pesticides, but it will not remove all of them. They say that even drying it with a cloth can remove more. A study published in Food Control took vegetables and soaked it in two different ways. One with vinegar for 20 minutes, as well as salt and water for 20 minutes to remove DDT, as well as a multitude of different pesticides. Now, both methods actually work pretty well. The problem with the vinegar, it left a funny taste from the residue on those vegetables. The salt and water actually worked okay as well, but it's still not the best. Now, Consumer Reports wrote that submerging apples in baking soda for two minutes removed more pesticide than a two minute soak in the bleach solution or two minutes of rinsing in running tap water. But it actually took 12 to 15 minutes to remove all the pesticides soaking in that baking solution. So the baking soda technique works very well. One teaspoon to two cups of water, let it soak for about 15 minutes. So the big question is, can I do this with all my fruits and vegetables? Apples and hard fiber works really well in this technique. But what about your berries? Berries are very fragile. I recommend just rinsing those berries and eat them right away. Because if you don't eat them right away, they will rot and spoil much quicker. For your potatoes, your pumpkin, your carrots, your squash, or any other hard surface, fruit or vegetable, get a good veggie brush. One of those soft brushes that you can clean it real well, and I think that should make a big difference. So even your mushrooms, with those berries, just rinse them with water, pat them dry, and I think you'll be real satisfied. I hope you enjoyed this video. I ask you to share it with your friends and family. Leave your comments below, and most important, make it a great day. I'm Dr. Alan Mandel.